Hello! Greetings! I have returned. Pardon the mild schnifflies. We're nearly cancelling tonight, but it has been way too long. And we need to get back into this. So, I will be continuing our lovely little Marvel stream on Friday. And then we have a nice little surprise on Saturday for you all. It'll be excellent. Anyway, for tonight I thought we'd kick back into a bit of retro, and since I haven't played this in a while, I tried it the other day, and let's see how far I can get. I'm not used to playing this on a gamepad, I'll be honest, it's normally mouse and keyboard, but uh, I'm showing my age here a bit, let's see. Let's go! Get a bit into the old doom. See how we're going. Let's get to the old doom, you know. Maybe I just need to put this up a little. Greetings, Scott. How are you doing, buddy? You keeping well? Happy birthday again. A little belated. I know I said it already, but still. Point made. Right. Go for a new game. We'll do Knee Deep in the Dead. Hey, not too rough, because it's been a while. Hey, Scott, how am I going anyway? Uh, volume, game volume up. Uh, mic volume down a little, maybe. I think I need to put my mic volume probably right about here. <sighs> Feeling a little bit sniffly, it was nearly cancelling, but thought, nope, it's been too long, need to get this sorted. So we're doing a bit retro tonight, back to Marvel on Friday, and a nice little surprise on Saturday. I can power through some of these now. I can remember some bits of these, others I forget quite a lot. So we'll see how well we're doing. Like I was saying before, I'm normally used to doing this on a mouse and keyboard, but we'll see. Now, run and skip most of the level. Die, dude, die! Because you can totally kill someone with a handgun at that distance. I'm aiming for the files just in case anyone's wondering. Not that it did him much damage. But yeah, it takes a bit to kill an imp with a handgun. What you been up to do? Did you have a good day yesterday? What you get up to? Tell me about it. Understandable dude. I'm just gonna take a bit of time to chill out and have fun as well. It's not just all about screaming. You know. I could go a little higher. Okay, thank you very much. Always good to know. I don't know, I keep having weird tech issues lately with this. Just minor little things, but enough to be a pain in the ass. We're going to the nuclear power plant. A smile on his face when he gets this shot. Didn't we keep going? All these little areas, a lot of people. Safi, how are you doing? And we need to do more Sea of Thieves world. Yes, we will. We need to play Sea of Thieves offline a little more, and we need to do more Warframe on stream. That's just a fact on that one. Now, can I remember where the bloody keys are half the time? That's the good trick. Oh, this brings such... This is so bringing me back, like... That's why I wanted to give this a go, because like this always brings me back and it's always such fun. Ugh. As the old post used to say, old soldiers never die, they just turn into blood crazy mutant zombies. I was gonna do it tonight, but I'm a bit too wrecked. But I will be getting to it, I tell you that. Ah.
it's amazing how you kind of remember why offline oh no just to get into the gist of it like to get ourselves leveled up you know get a bit more gold and stuff like that <laughs> that's specifically the only reason i love playing it offline all the time as well as online Ooh. You can tell anyone that used to play this on the PC, by the way, versus a console player, because console players normally never straight. Normally, there's always exceptions to the rule, like that. Yeah, we got this, we got this. Offline, well, not so much offline, off screen is what I meant, you know? It is. It is the ocean, man. I'm telling you. I love it. I could sit and play that game all day, just specifically going through the ocean aesthetic of it. Oh, hold on, let me get this here. Here. Wait, is this it? There we go. Hey, Nick, how you doing? We're gonna see if I can remember how to get through this. <laughs> Even for an almost automatic aiming game, my aim is terrible. And they turn into red mist. Take that out. Please help. Yes, it did. <clears throat> You've never played Doom. Oh, dude. It's on Game Pass. Give the new one a shot. <laughs> That's all. It may not be for you, but it is something everyone needs to at least try. Careful of them tricksy imps. Or to blow yourself up with a barrel, that's the other one. That's one of my favorite tricks to do. You thought you were gonna surprise me, didn't you? Well, you spent years surprising me, not any longer. Double hockey sticks. I do about three years ago, but I didn't enjoy. Well, it's not for everyone, dude. As I'm saying, it is for some people, not for others. Like, I'm a huge uh, Doom and Quake fan. Surprisingly, they're the only FPSs I really enjoy. Don't really enjoy a lot of other ones, but those ones are definitely. That's my bag, man, if you know what I mean. Like in this one, there's a load of, there's like nine epi nine chapters per episode. And uh, each one of these is quite fun. But they're quite challenging. This used to be the one that was given out to everyone because this came out on freeware. Or shareware, is it back in the day? So what would happen is you'd get like the game for free or you'd get like this for free. And then what would happen is you'd actually have to like, if you wanted the rest of the game, you'd have to pay money for it, which is cool. It's kind of like a teasing demo. Most of them out. Grab around, grab everything, and get the heck out of here. You see, this game is the reason why Doom got so angry. <clears throat> oh, I, I hate when that happens. It does happen quite often, but try not to worry too much about bloody Twitter. They, uh, they act up constantly. Just use it as something as a reminder for yourself and other people. Don't depend on it. It's a bloody disaster. You might recognize some really awesome uh, 
<laughs> ripped off metal soundtracks to this. That's what Doom was famous for as well. <clears throat> what is this the reason I'm into metal? Nah, I was listening to Alice Cooper way before I ever played Doom. <clears throat> Definitely. So what the rest of you guys been up to today? Any madness? Not out at any close range though. Oh damn it. I still didn't find the keys, because I'm just that smart, I've ran around in an entire circle. <laughs> yeah, I think it was this way. Hey, camera girl! Looks like we're gonna get- I know! It's a disgrace! Like, I've got that, I've run horror conventions, I've had many Jasons in this country at a horror convention in Dublin. I had Kane shortly after he actually done the promo work for that bloody game and those people are terrible to get back to. I wouldn't mind if they even came back and say, look, there's a mess up, it's going to be a week or something. As long as it's something. But getting ignored, man, that's a disaster. And that's what rightly pisses me off too. But don't worry, we'll get it in the end. Congratulations on the leaving the results, by the way. Better watching the boys. I told you, Scott, didn't I? I told you, it's worth the watch. I need to finish it now, because I started it, but I have a bit to go in it. I think I'm only like four episodes or five episodes in. <clears throat> okay, how am I keep missing all this stuff? I know I used to just fly through this bloody game, and now I seem to be completely friggin' incompetent. Ah, it was in here. Right. Funny note, that symbol used to be a swastika and they had to change it and censor it because everyone got really angry about it. Message their support and the response I got is, oh, what did they say? I'm surprised they got back to you. They wouldn't get back to me. Bloody cheeky git. Our team is working as quickly as they can to get the game out into all regions. As soon as we have a definite time frame, we will let everyone. Yeah, they said they'll get back to me as well, but you had no update, man. It's ridiculous. It's a disgrace. But I wouldn't mind if they just told us what it is, because it's not the rating thing. That's a load of BS. There is a reason. I don't know what it is, but it's not that rating thing. That's a load of crap. Because the Peggy rating thing as well, like you said, for it's only for music and for movies and stuff. The whole concept of the Peggy rating system is voluntary. There's no mandatory rating system. So they're spilling a pile of crap. How am I such a muppet? I've missed where I'm supposed to be going here. Bet you I was meant to take this and go down the other way, wasn't I? Oh, I just brought that down, unless... Did I hit this switch? That opens something else, I wonder. Mm. 
I'm telling you, I'm a complete muppet. I'm going to be running around this game in circles for ages. Okay, let's check this map again. Done that, done that, done that. Alright, let's go back that way, so. Whoop. <laughs> like I want to go with them, but I'll get blocked. Yes, you will. That's the cruel hard facts of modern social media. They'll all play the victim instead of having any bit of social responsibility. I wouldn't mind, but if they told us, but they're quite common for having, gun media are common since they started for having a terrible, terrible public relations issue. Because, like, I can say it on here because it doesn't matter, and you can ask the man himself, Payne Hodder thinks they're a pile of so-and-sos. I don't want to get my stream banned, but yeah, he didn't have a lot of positive words to say about them, and neither did Ari. Harry Lay when he played the first Jason. It's already filming. Nice. Once you get good in Doom 4, it becomes a horror game for the demons. <laughs> That's what it says there. Uh, it has the picture of Dark Souls, and it says, Dark Souls, you're locked in here with demons. Doom, the demons are locked in here with you. What the hell am I missing? Yeah, need blue key, no blue key. I'm in Egypt, you know that. There's something around here somewhere that I've just completely ran past and not even seen. Did I missed it in here or something? I bloody did, because I'm a Muppet! Well, it turns out Mike's a Muppet. <laughs> oh crap, I remember this being a disaster. Okay. Take them one wing at a time until I remember which the right one is. Nothing there. Pinky! Come here, you Muppet. <laughs> Means me. This one goes nowhere as well, if I remember. I even asked Matt if he could tell me the name of the bloody rating board. Yeah, exactly. I asked the same thing, and they're not going to say it because it's not the rating board. That's why. I said, point us in the right direction. I'll go knock some heads, but no. Figuratively, of course. One thing I love about the boys on Amazon is they do everything and Marvel DC. Exactly. It's basically what happens in superheroes are dick. Which way do we go? I got this one try it first. Jump to the face. One one. Peace. Yeah, yellow key cat, right. We're sorted, lads. It's gravy. We're getting out of here. Getting the heck out of here, finally. Way. Here's me getting lost in the next. <laughs> awesome. I'm not how ready to show. Yeah, well, they needed something to go against Netflix, to be honest. And there's another one coming out. I think it's called Carnival Row or something. Then like a fantasy one. It's looking pretty good, man. It's coming out at the end of the month. Man, all I wanted to do was live stream a bit of horror. You know? Hmm. The Friday the 13th. Like, I love it on the PS4, but having it mobile would have been way better. But apparently, once again, the Irish get ignored, because you can just ignore us, because we're irrelevant, apparently. According to the rest of the bloody world. Yeah, I know. 
And they're just ignoring us and hoping it goes away. Well, being a jackass. Like, if they were a little bit more transparent about it, we could be a little bit cooler with the situation, but they're not even doing that. Not too good at it because I kind of suck at the survival game. Kill everyone. Keep running, keep shooting. Yes. Don't stand there because they'll, uh, they'll just keep whacking you. Wait. Oh yeah, there was armor up there. Crap. Not worth it. Totally not worth it. <laughs> I know, right? Trust me, I know the feeling all too well. I'm going to walk in here and more are going to show up, aren't they? Where's the rest of you? Telling you, I was half tempted to pick up the Friday the 13th puzzle game because I have it in my phone. I was going to pick that up on the Switch and stream that and say, you know, mm, the gun media, but eh, they don't care. They don't care because enough people are just going to keep buying it anyway. There's like, there's hardcore fans like myself and all. Like, you can go through my Twitter and stuff. Not my gamer Twitter, my real Twitter. I've been a Friday the 13th fan my whole life. I even helped sort a horror convention to bring them to this country. And when I told the guys in Good Media that, asking for some PR stuff, I didn't want anything free, just some, like, things I could do at our convention to, like, help promote their game. I was ignored. But they'll give it out to a few streamers who will play it for a few days on stream and then ignore, ignore it and let the game die. But, hmm, awfully disappointing. And we are... On here, we're getting closer. It's sickening when everyone else can play. You can't. You can keep refreshing the page on the website, and it'll show up with the British one for a split second. And you click on it and say not available. Like the idea of like you can either put it to this way when it comes there, right? You're either pro Brexit or anti Brexit. You're pro Brexit, okay? What are the Brits doing? Okay, they marked it as an 18s game. Fair enough. It's an 18s game. Release it as that. If you're the other way, it's like, okay, we're with the EU. What did the EU do? They marked it as 18, marked it as an 18s game and released it. It's already been marked as 18s on the PlayStation and Xbox, so it gets the same rating. So they're full of crap. There's something else that's the problem that they're not saying. And the fact that it's only Ireland and not the UK, like if it was the UK and Ireland, I'd think there was some issue with the store. But the fact that it's only us, there's some problem that they're lying about. I got some bought one of those power pack and stand. Oh, snap, dude! <laughs> snap. <laughs> I've done the exact same. Nice. Awesome. <laughs> done the same thing, but... Uh, it's not sus, right? On the upside, it'll get a bit of use for Warframe. It feels like such a rip, man, you know?
Careful of that trap, you can get caught in that and killed quite easy. How dare you, Pinky? Pinky trying to charge us off the end. Don't see us care more about money than making fans happy. Exactly. Well, don't get me started. That's not even a complete and finished game. They managed to somehow make the game and get the legal rights to it, but not all of the legal rights and end up in a massive lawsuit. I wouldn't mind, but like I'd emailed when I was still doing the horror stuff, I'd emailed Sean Cunningham and he doesn't understand how they bothered to go ahead with stuff without securing the fact that they had the rights to each version of Jason. But hey, idiots to do idiot things, huh? Crap, I hated this bit. Okay, if I remember correctly, we just go straight. I think this gets messy getting into hell is really annoying. I'm not too sure. We'll check. We'll check on the way out. Like, there's no chance we're getting it tonight because whatever freaking rating board office on their clothes. Yeah, if it was genuinely a rating board thing, man, in Ireland, I wouldn't trust them. They will take way too long, you know, and need to get all sorts of brown envelopes and bribery and make sure someone's cousin got a job with the company and all that kind of crap. All right, so now we got all keys. We should be all good now. Good. Wait, hold on. I thought I seen you. Geeky git. Can't even trust them. Bring an invisible demon. Like I knew I was gonna be eaten. <laughs> oh, I had to go up that way. Uh, the other way around if we didn't go through that way. Oh, 
right. Like UK and Ireland should have gotten the game launch. Yeah, I know. I can't understand why they're doing this thing of releasing things digitally and then releasing them like a month later physically. They've done the same with like Darksiders and other stuff. And all it's doing is it's just guaranteed to kill the bloody market. Like, It's guaranteed to kill any chance they ever had of like, you know, of anyone buying it non-digitally. I went the bloody wrong way because I'm a muppet. I went my myself right round in a circle instead of finishing the left. Let's see the way I was meant to go. Hidden door. Hmm. It seems like there's a hidden door there, but I guess right. Being the same times and same time zone, same issue, same rules for everything, but not for that. Same rules for everything else, but not that apparently. Which I can't understand for the life of me why. But you know, bugger us, we don't matter, right? There was something I did to open that gate over to that. What was it? I distinctly remember there being a switch. Or did I already hit it and it went down again and I have to go ahead and... It's up here, isn't it? Yeah, I have to go hit the bloody thing again, do it. Nope. Has I the dumbs? I has the dumbs. Just run. Bugger it. Oh, yeah. This is in case you're completely wrecked by this time. Nearly wrecked myself there. I didn't kill the pinky. Damn you, invisible pinky. He's dead. Invisible pinky is no more. Exit. Finally, jeez. I don't know, man. It's just one depressing bit after another. Hopefully soon. Hopefully we'll have a resolution by Friday. The latest. Every day hoping for tomorrow, like, but I've no faith in it. Not happening, Pinky. <laughs> Red miss. Funny factor in the new Doom, there is little levers you can pull, and in every one of those levels, it gives a little excerpt to these. And you can actually replay the entire level in the new Doom engine. Funny story. Oh, I distinctly remember getting lost in this level.
No, we've been through this, yeah. Yeah, I don't do surprises, just instant shock or blast to the face. for going up there, but whatever. I can't believe I'm sitting here streaming a 25 year old game and I love it just as much as when it came out. Is that weird? Am I weird for that? I know, and this is what I, I thought there was something very sus whenever they didn't have it up to pre-order. You know when they say in the coming soon section of the store, they didn't have it up there. And that really pissed me off, man. I don't trust that at all. wrong somehow? Yeah, I'm a muppet. That's what I tell you when it's been many, many long days. <laughs> ah, red door. Now we're on the right track. Here we get the blue key. Now you're sucking diesel, boy.
I don't remember what that switch is for, but I distinctly remember I needed to press that switch. Getting closer to hell. Orchid. Although it's the rest of it's not going to be this easy. <laughs> Dear, I think I remember what this is. Right. Time to see what I'm made of. Let's do this. Right, guys, I hope you're paying attention. Let's see the Doom Slayer fight his first levels of hell. jinx it but I'm dodging quite well I can take one down to be happy can I get him direct on with a rocket launcher and he'll take it too, holy crap! That's it! That's tougher than I remembered. Yeah, they got the quad damage. Oh, the partial invisibility, sorry. Not quad damage, partial invisibility. Ugh. Hell awaits, boys. Hell awaits. <laughs> You've no other way but to it. Once you beat the big badass and clean out the moon base, you're supposed to win, aren't you? Aren't you? Where's your fat reward and ticket home? What the hell is this? It's not supposed to end this way. It stinks like rotten meat, but looks like the lost the emo space. Looks like you're stuck on the shores of hell. The only way out is through. To continue to Doom Experience, play the Shores of Hell in its amazing sequel, Inferno. That's what I was talking about earlier with the shareware. Years ago, you'd get this for free. And then you'd have to send off to pay for, like, the other chapters and all, which is quite awesome. But yeah, guys, that was quite a cool little playthrough. Doom goes well for the streaming bit, I realized. Never thought about that. Hmm, we may have to change pace. Although, yeah, on Friday we're still going back and we're going to get through more of Ultimate Alliance, get that finished, and have a fun little surprise on Saturday. And then once that... <clears throat> once... Bloody hell. Once that is all, that was short. That's only chapter one, or rather, E one M one is the first level. So this is episode one, and there's like four or five episodes. I'll check again when we start. I'll go back through, but I'm not going to go through the whole thing. This is only the first episode, and there's like four or five episodes for the whole game with nine chapters in each one. Is it nine? Whatever. Love the music. I'm just going to pump that up a bit. <laughs> awesome. Get some multiplayer action going on in this. Actually, some co-op will be epic. Yeah, I'm getting ready. Yeah, bugger it. I'm going through all my superhero stuff, as in per promise. But uh, yeah, we're going to be building up to this for Doom, Doom 2, Doom 3, Doom 2016. All the way until Doom Eternal. Yeah, that was awesome, guys. That was a fun little run. I finished a little bit early, but at least I got that sorted. And I'm going to keep checking, see have we got any replies from Gun Media. Maybe the 13th, I have a funny, funny feeling we don't. Any replies? Nope. Nope. 
I love the fact as well, if you go on to their page... Where are we? There's so many of the replies, can't even see the bloody thing. Uh, you got a Friday the 13th. At Friday 13th game on Twitter, it says Friday 13th is available on no on the Nintendo Switch everywhere except not in Ireland. Which Gamer Dales is the first uh, comment that comes up under that. So yay! Not in Ireland, along with me complaining, bitching, and moaning, which really annoys me because it did say this content is not available to purchase in the eShop yet. But now it says this content is no longer available to purchase. What happened? Something changed, something updated, man. What the hell? Oh, that's why I need to get on here and raise a little bit of hell. Anyway, right. That's going to be enough for tonight, guys. I shall see you again on Friday. Long stream with a special guest who's not here but should be here <laughs> for Saturday. And we are going to have <laughs> it's going to be awesome. Let's just put it to you that way. I know I use that word a lot, but it's going to be awesome. All right, guys. Thanks for joining in. You will find more Marvel Ultimate Alliance on Friday, but we'll continue our game adventures next week as well once we get that finished. All right, guys. Do you.